London has long been a city teeming with Irish diaspora. And for many, Gaelic football is at the heart of maintaining their Irish roots. No one embodies that sense of dual identity better than Liam Gavahan, a London native born to Irish parents who has fought to become captain of their senior football team. I'm a signal engineer on the London Underground. Leading a team on a football pitch and then having a job that has responsibility and has pressures. You have to be regimental on yourself, you have to be strict on yourself and you know very disciplined. It ties in with Gaelic football because the amount we're training and the level we are at, you, you have to be disciplined anyway. My job is a bit different. Working nights has its challenges. Changing my whole body clock at the weekend for a game, that can be tough. But again, you just have to prepare yourself and be disciplined and just make it work. How does someone born and raised in London get into Gaelic football? My parents, uh, they came over in 88. Typical Irish uh, story, they planned to be here for a couple of years, but it, they've been here for 30 odd years. I started Gaelic football when I was about eight. We didn't really have an inter-county footballer that we could relate to. So I used to love watching Kieran McDonald from Mayo. Locked down with Connolly. What he could do with a ball was just amazing. Watching these lads play makes you want to go down and train harder and try and be that good. When I was younger, coming into the senior setup, it was majority Irish changing room. I was an English-born kid, went to school here. It had its challenges, no doubt. Sometimes I felt maybe you had to be that extra 10% better to get on the team. But you just had to keep the head down, keep working, and earn that respect from the lads around you in that change room. I mean, what is the commitment like for somebody in London to play for the county team? He gives up a lot of his social life. Even when he goes to Ireland and he comes back late at night, he will still go to work. We're all extremely proud of him. He works very hard. Even to play for London it would have been a dream, never mind to captain them as well. I was very emotional when I saw him lead out his team. And I get very nervous when he's playing. I usually have to get up and walk away for a while because my heart is pounding. My first impressions when I saw him about the age of 15, but he just seemed to have something special about him. And within a couple of years, he was uh, obviously involved in the London senior squad. I have no doubt that he could he could make a name for himself in any county set up at home. Having someone like him has brought more London-born players through. It's very important to have all the, the, the core of the team to be from London. It's their county, um, and it just means that there's not as much turnover then. Coming into the big games, there's just an extra bite in training. There's a higher intensity. They want to perform well and they want to be in the team for the big day. I think we all deserve that big day out against the big teams. And you want to test yourself against the best and see where you stand. When I go out there, I want to lead from the front and hopefully the lads can get behind me and we can put in a performance together. Being English born, you know, London is my county. What drives me on year after year is, you know, to experience that championship win in Rice with the whole London GA community and, you know, the big crowd behind us. Spending time with the Irish community here has shown me just how important it is for them to keep their heritage alive. And Liam's dedication is testament to that. London are on the same pursuit as every county team in Ireland to proudly represent their jersey for the chance of glory on that one day. <laughs>